Hi, I'm Sandy Belcher, the creator of 2D Cutie Tutus, and today I'd like to show you how to make a fairy wand, magic wand, puff. The supplies you'll need are some tool, 6 by 25 yards, some ribbon, it don't have to be double faced. And seven eighths of an inch would be perfect for wrapping around the dowel. But I got one and a half inch here. This is all I have right now. So I'll see also need a wooden dowel, needle and thread, some scissors, a hot glue gun. And something to wrap the tool around and also a lighter. I'm making a wand for a dress I made that comes with it, a Tinkerbell. So I figure why not do a tutorial on how to make First the wand. First thing you do is you get your stick here and your ribbon. I'm going to leave it on the spool. That way I don't waste any or cut it too short. Seal the edges. Well, see how it's really frayed here? Go ahead and cut it if it's like that. And then seal the edge with your lighter. If these are on there still, it might catch on fire. <laughs> okay, so got your stick and I just take if you got one that's the ribbon that's one side shiny, make sure the shiny side's obviously facing outward. So I'm gonna find like the end here in the middle and get your hot glue gun stick a little glue at the top there and then each corner I want to glue down like that this will be the part where they hold the wand Then you take the other corner glue that down then what you do put some glue down like that take your wand and slowly turn it turn it this way Glue the top here. Let's turn tightly. And with hot glue, you gotta be kind of fast because it won't glue good when it gets hard. If you got any gaps like that, go ahead and glue them down. That's why the seven eighths of an inch is better. It's too wide. But it'll work. I'll run out of glue. So just, just continue, just stick some glue like so. Turn. Do a little at a time. So I'm going to go all the way down like that. And I'll be back. Okay, so I got towards the end here. 
a little, a little further down. And this part gets a little tricky. Go ahead and cut off the rest here. Take your lighter. Seal the edge. And stick some glue here. And do the end. Right here, just fold it. Some glue. Whoops. Not on that side. This side. <laughs> this side don't matter so much as what it looks like because that's where the puff will go. Okay, so the next step you'll do is you'll get your needle and thread and make sure you tie a biggish knot at the end. And then make sure you have it kind of long. I'm gonna put three little knots at the end. I'll make a bigger shot at the end. Put that to the side. And get your thing you're gonna wrap your tool around. Keep it on there and what I'm going to do is hold it on the end. Keep it kind of scrunched and just keep wrapping it around. The more times you wrap it around, the poofier the puff will be. Ten. I'll do about ten hooks. And just cut it here. We're gonna slip this off. And Keep it together there. I'm gonna take your needle and thread. You're gonna put it through the very center. Whoops. Then you will wrap. A thread around the very center. Just a few times. And then go through the middle again. This will keep the tool in place. Do it again from this angle. And I want to put a knot. A few times. Of, so it will stay. Cut off the rest. And the fun. You'll see that each side has like a loop cut straight across the top here. You wanna do that on the other side too.
Now what you're gonna do, spread it around. Spread it apart or whatever. Make it puffy. You'll notice that it's uneven probably. So just cut the long pieces off. This is where this bag comes in handy. So that's the most time consuming part of this project. <laughs> You'll go around, kind of find a spot that where the thread is, kind of. It's kind of bold spot. And you want to take your stick. The end that you ended up with, not the not the beginning. So this is a nice part that it can hold. Um, the other end, glue. Take your glue gun. And. You gotta be kind of fast on this. Put some glue at the end, the top kinda, and around a bit. And you're gonna stick it right in the middle and press very hard and hold it there a while. So after it's dry and on there firmly, You're almost done. I kind of go like this and it poofs out more. But if there's any long pieces, go ahead and cut them off. And you could put, get some little thin ribbon and you can glue it right at the top there and let it hang down. That looks nice. Put about three of them hanging down. Or since this is Tinkerbell, I have, I made it kind of flat on one side and I glued a, a felt star that I cut out. Put a star right there. And then the other side I put a little Bell. I sewed on so a little bell. So that's how you make a fairy wand. I hope you like my video. Feel free to subscribe, like, and comment. I got several other videos on how to make tutu dresses. If you like, watch those. I'll put links to click on. And also visit my shop on Etsy. Search Tootie Cutie Tutus. I have several different tutu Link dresses. Link will be in the there. description. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.